Welcome back. Santa's got his reindeer to help him fly, but at O'Hare's Terminal 1 this week, travelers are getting some help with their Christmas plans from some very special dogs. This is Sylvia. And she loves love, basically. Sylvia was getting lots of love today. The two-year-old Labradoodle, one of about two dozen comfort dogs in the United Airlines Terminal at O'Hare. They were helping travelers cope with the stress of flying during the holidays. I instantly smiled when I walked by. It's nice, especially when you're stuck in the airport for a couple hours. <laughs> O'Hare is one of seven airports nationwide where the United Paws program has been offered this holiday season. United understands that this is a, a stressful uh, period for, for a lot of travelers. Even the most seasoned traveler may uh, find him or herself getting a little stressed. Sometimes it's hard to tell who's more excited to be here, the travelers flying out of O'Hare or the dogs who were here to greet them. And why wouldn't the dogs love it? They get kissed by children, scratched behind their ears, they're adored by babies, and their photographs are shared all over the world. Ready, one, two, three. Oh, that's so sweet. And all the while, providing some important benefits for anxious holiday travelers. Research has actually showed that petting a dog for five minutes can reduce uh, blood pressure. It actually uh, releases a hormone uh, that is associated with bonding and affection. For travelers like Jared Fruland, who was catching a flight to Seattle, the bonding and affection were appreciated. Just a nice little, you know, warm, warm feeling before you jump on a plane for four hours across the country. So, yeah, it's a good, nice little holiday treat. This is the second year for the United Paws program, and the airline says the reaction has been overwhelmingly positive. 